Alright, let's try this. Let's go to Google SketchUp. Really fun tools. Let's just start using SketchUp if you're on feet and inches. We're gonna delete the little man. It's only used for scale modeling. And what we are what we are going to start with is a rectangle. We're gonna start but with a uh, twenty twenty foot by ten foot. And then we're gonna do And we're going to do a 10 foot by 10 foot. And what we're going to do is erase the middle line. So now they become one whole piece. So that each one is 20 by 20. Each side on these sides are 20 by 20. And the rest of these are 10, 10, and 10. Now, what we're going to use is the push-pull tool. And we're going to pull this up. Seven foot. Regular ceiling height. And it's going to look like a dopey little shed. We're going to make that dopey little shed look cool with a cool looking roof. We're going to use the line tool. And what we're going to do is we're going to draw a line. But first, before you even finish that line, I want you to go down here to this other midpoint and pull it up. See how it snaps to that green spot? Now pull it up until you reach the red line. And that is where you stop there and you continue until you hit the midpoint. That is what should happen. Now from here to here and then here to here. Now what we're gonna do is try some cool thing. snap hold on it was something to do with the snap into the purple line I lost it so we're gonna snap to that purple line if I can find it again seven foot Let's just do that, you know. There we go. Let's try this again, you know. We're going to try it from different spots, you know. Trying to make it look cool. But it's not going to come out always as perfect because, you know, let's just say this is Google SketchUp is not always going to come out perfect, huh? And we're going to erase those lines. And what we're going to do is going to grab the Select tool, which we are going to press Control and Select. Oops. And select these two lines right here. We're going to grab the move tool. And we're going to go like this. And go up. Now let's just go up by three foot, you know. And there is your cool s roof. I like to be a little fun with my thing and. What we're going to do is we're going to put some paint on there. There is, if you go to the paint bucket, this usually pops up. Once this usually pops up, there are so many different materials. There is asphalt and concrete, blinds and brick and cladding, carpet and textiles, colors, colors, name, fencing, 
geometric tile, ground cover, markers, material symbols, and then we move farther down the line, metal, roofing, sketchy, stone, tile, tonal patterns, translucent, vegetation, water, and wood. Water's pretty cool, you know. But, what we're going to use is roofing, if you can find that. I like to go with something that looks natural, which would be this one. Pretty close to being natural, anyway. And if you do this, they all look like you're on top of your house. Very cool, right? Yeah, I thought so. We're going to make somewhat of some gutters. Not really good with that, but the cool thing is we can just do offset. And I'm going with two inches. And we push pull that up. Six foot. Six foot. And six inches. See? So, that is the cool thing. Pretty cool, right? I thought so, because I'm not really good at this either. It's actually pretty crazy, you know. Well, this is my pre- Whoops. Oh, yeah, gotta click the 